Health Break, brought to you by CHI St. Joseph Health. More than 600,000 hysterectomies are performed in the U.S. every year. Dr. Larry Butler says that if a woman needs a hysterectomy, she should understand the many different ways it can be performed. People talk about a total hysterectomy, which would mean removal of the womb itself and the cervix in both tubes and ovaries. My recommendation would be for a woman that needs a hysterectomy to take the womb itself and her fallopian tubes but leave the ovaries for the benefit for her bones for osteoporosis prevention and for cardiovascular benefit. And recent advances in surgical techniques can have great benefits as well. Now we have minimally invasive techniques and we have vaginal surgery. A robotically assisted approach is a very good, good method. Most of our patients go home the day after surgery and some of them the day of surgery. After a week, they're back to driving. They're taking care of their kids once they go home. They can get back to pretty much functionality in a week or two after a minimally invasive approach. For more information, go to chistjosephhealth.org. I'm Beverly Herbert.